What's up, guys? John Anthony here from John Anthony Lifestyle. Last night, I hit 1,234 girls. One, two, three, four. Okay, and it's kind of symbolic because I just kind of put a huge jump start onto things to set things in motion again yesterday. Okay, and today. I put out the call for interns video, shitloads of people. Um, always really nice to see that a lot of people are very interested in working uh, for the company. Guys wrote up big long bios and um, all their qualifications and all that stuff. Um, I've brought on from freelancers, um, people to do video editing again, people to do thumbnails. I'm gonna go into regular cranking of content again. Okay, I'm gonna aim for a video a day. I know it's ambitious, but I'm gonna aim for a value video a day. Okay, this, this video here is an update video, but I'm gonna try to always put out on every single video something of very high value, okay? Content, free, valuable content, a very high value. Um, so I wanted to ask you guys, my followers, my viewers, uh, which topics would you like to see? I already have a big list of stuff to cover. But let me know here um, which topics you guys would like me to go into in depth with, okay? I'll probably do one roast per week, okay? That'll be one of the videos per week. Um, I can do some kind of breakdown video, um, either of infield footage or of like a, a text situation or some kind of interaction where I'm just recounting the situation, exactly what happened. I have a million of those. Um, as well as going over fundamentals of game, okay? Um, but there's all kinds of shit again in the works, all right? I'm gonna be taking the, the channel seriously again. Um, for those of you that bought Corona Pickup, um, I promised everyone a free call. I've, I've been doing those, but there are a ton of people that bought since the price was $50. So I have interns now circling back around and contacting people. Um, I'm also gonna have to cut down on the chicks a little bit. I saw five different chicks yesterday. Only one of those was the new one. Um, but yeah, I'm also resuming work on my autobiography and I'm setting a firm date of January 1st for the release date, final draft, to be done by September of this year. Okay, and then all the publication stuff. But that's going to be recounting my entire life. All right, my whole pickup journey going from zero to a thousand girls, now one, two, three, four girls. Um, talking about various things, you know, ranging from childhood abuse, giving me the drive to really push hard in this field, as well as hyper analytical, just basically a genetic luck of the draw to be able to analyze things in very algorithmic flowcharts and systems and processes. Um, I'm also going to be bringing on other top guys that I respect for interviews. Okay, so there's going to be all kinds of cool shit. There'll be interviews, breakdowns, we're going to have blasts and roasts. And they, the, the purpose of these blasts and roasts isn't just to, you know, be a hater and, and just talk shit or whatever. I want to really dismantle why a particular coach industry has no business coaching, exactly why their game is off in a bunch of various technical ways, as well as other fun, juicy tidbits uh, and slanders. Okay, no roast of mine would be complete without those. Uh, but yes, so the book is, is back into production. Look out for daily value videos. Okay, they're going to be sleek, there's going to be video editing, there's going to be good thumbnails, okay, moving into 10,000 subscribers and beyond. Um, I firmly see myself as leaps and bounds ahead of anyone else in this industry, okay, the followers do not reflect that, the channel's popularity do not reflect that, largely because I did not give two shits before. Um, but I'd like to really let things shine, okay? I, I know this stuff inside out. I could talk about it endlessly forever. Um, I've pretty much seen and done everything in the game by now, which was true many, year, you know, many years ago. 
Um, I hit my first 100 girls in June 2012. Uh, lots of the community still has not done that. That was almost eight years ago, okay? Um, let's see, I hit 1,000 in December of 2018. Okay, so that was 900 girls in six years, okay? Um, but yes, I just wanted to put out this video here. Watch out for daily value videos coming. And I, I really want to encourage you guys, and I'm going to be putting in calls to action in every video. But the more that you guys like these videos, the more that you share these videos, and the more watch time that accumulates on these videos, the more YouTube will show them to people. Um, and that's how we can really grow the channel. Okay, so every time you see a new video, if it helps you, okay, they're going to be packed with value as, as all my value videos of the past have been. Practical, actionable takeaways, things broken down in very easy, straightforward terms. But if you receive value, like it, share it, and put it in your local WhatsApp group, your local Facebook groups, etc. Okay, just get in the habit of doing that. If everyone does that, it's going to really snowball things and help things move a lot faster. Okay, and it's going to be more motivation for me to actually give a shit. Okay, um, but I'm just going to be a lot more methodical about this stuff rather than scrambling each day. Oh, I need to get a video out. I need to get a video out. I'm going to queue stuff up about a week in advance. Okay, so I'm going to just have recording sessions. And there's 42 different beaches in uh, Florianopolis. Okay, 42. That's right. There's one right over there. One right over there behind the dip. Um, some of the most beautiful beaches in the world, but I'm going to be taking the camera out. You know, I have a wide open schedule that I usually fill with chicks. But I'm going to be devoting time to just going. I'm going to have my list of topics. I'm going to do my recordings. Send that shit off to the editor. Okay, send the send the um, the YouTube titles and thumbnails or the the thumbnail information off to the graphic designer. Blah blah blah. Not that anyone really gives a shit, but that's going to be. <laughs> That's going to be the process. I'm going to have exact, I think, I think the exact time that I'm going to release a video each day will be at 2 p.m. Eastern. Okay, so 2 p.m. Eastern, 11 a.m. Pacific. That seems to be what statistics and research on YouTube have found to be the most beneficial time. So every day, 2 p.m. is going to be my release time and it's going to be just fucking jammed with value all right but like i said like share pass this shit along if you find value in it um everything reopened yesterday in florianopolis and it's the only city in brazil where they reopen shit during the corona stuff so the gym is back open i'm actually going to go to the gym right after this video here um i'm down about four or five kilograms about 10 pounds since i arrived a couple months ago 10 weeks ago just due to lack of working out during this coronavirus bullshit um this also i also want to mention two other quick things related to that to things reopening here um i am available for running live programs on florinopolis okay the airport is open here society has reopened here if you want to come out I can train you up hard and all the online stuff. We can do day game approaches with masks on. Um, nightclubs are still closed, probably for at least another month. Um, and I do have a Miami program that was scheduled to happen uh, in March that has been postponed, but people are still asking about that. If you're interested in joining that, um, there is, right now we have two guys um, and I will take three I basically I do a three to one ratio okay so well, there, there's one more spot there one guy's doing um, a seven day one guy's doing a three day okay so but it will be a seven day stretch if you're interested in that John Anthony lifestyle gmail.com or if you have interest in training with me in Florianopolis John Anthony lifestyle gmail.com and what was the last thing um, oh yeah, the Corona Pickup product, coronapickup.com. The sale, the $50 entry price, including a free call with me and a free month in my mastermind mentorship group. It's $50 for two days only, okay? On Sunday, I'm gonna bump that up to 99 bucks, okay? 
um, and it's it's worth far more than that. I have guys creating testimonials right now. Like, let me let me just fucking read one real quick, and I'll put a screenshot of this up on the screen. Um, this dude says, "This just came through today. Just went through the Corona fifty dollar training. God damn, boy, that shit was fire. Thank you for making it so cheap in all caps." Even 16 year olds can afford it. Every 16 year old needs this. I grew up with a role model, never been shy around women, but never had a pro teach me either. Your stuff shows everything from absolutely zero to get sex and a great relationship. I learned more in two hours from you than in my entire life leading up to this. I'm getting all your shit and I'm a Jew, so that means something, LOL. All right, that, that $50 price in that Corona, <clears throat> that was really just like a big favor, okay, to you guys. Um, yes, it is still money, but it's really my latest and greatest online game stuff on steroids. And a lot of people have been saying, what's the difference between Occam's Razor and Leeds Machine and Corona? And I'm going to make a video explaining the difference between those three. But um, the Corona stuff will get you annihilating results even post-Corona, post-quarantine times. Okay, I just named it Corona Pickup because it has very specific... Corona adaptations, but it's just a small part. The rest of it is my online game system on steroids. CoronaPickup.com. Two more days at the $50 price, that's going up to $100. Um, what else? Yeah, that's pretty much it. If you have any other questions about any of this stuff, like I said, the people that purchased, we are circling back to get those calls scheduled. Um, if you are watching this and you purchased um, and you have not yet sent me your WhatsApp number, send me that over email and what else yeah I'm just really excited about all this shit um, we're coming up on 10,000 subscribers I've just been reinvigorated with a big push and lots of amazing shit to come and it's gonna be fun ripping up all these fucking idiot coaches a lot of this you guys can thank Chris Wilde from Social Prime I messaged him and he happened to say some particularly faggot retard remarks which is characteristic of, of Chris um, and I just thought to myself, a 22-year-old kid, okay, who's frail, beta, has no business in this industry, okay, I, I would run into him, because he was living in Warsaw as well when I was last year, I would run into him, he'd be with like 10 dudes, okay, in the mall. And I just saw him and his, his two coworkers for Social Prime, just these fucking, like, li like, absolutely, like, definition of, like, children. Okay, they're running around saying they've made the greatest discoveries in the history of psychology, okay, better than Freud and, and B.F. Skinner, okay, and they firmly believe this, and they have guys drinking the Kool-Aid and following them around, and what are they telling the guys to do? Okay, first of all, okay, Chris Wilde pulled me aside one of those days, and he said, oh, all ten of us are taking LSD tonight, okay, because it opens their mind. They're literally giving hard drugs to kids in the programs, okay, multiple inside sources, including to myself personally, when they tried to do a time travel with me, which is going back into your childhood traumas, they offered me ecstasy, okay, MDMA. This is what they do. He says, it doesn't work unless you take LST or MDMA. Okay, so what they're doing is guys are, are signing up for a training on how to get good with women. They're having them take hard drugs. Okay, that's a fact. They've denied it. It's a fact. And then they are encouraging them to just really open up. And these are drug-induced, extremely traumatic recountings of childhood trauma. And then these guys have this crazy, euphoric, drug-induced emotional experience, and they think they measure that as that measure of success, okay? That's their measure of success with this program for getting better with women. And when they're in the, doing the cold approaches, okay, during, in these malls and other such, such things, they're encouraging these guys to go up to these random stranger girls and tell them about their childhood, their traumatic childhood. And the girls are like, what the fuck? Of course, right? <clears throat> these guys are not getting laid on the programs. And they walk away saying, oh, I, you know, that was extreme. They're, they're looking at, like, the level of, like, emotional, you know, craziness that happened. Of course you're going to have an emotional experience when you're talking about traumatic shit while on ecstasy or LSD, okay? And then they're charging guys several thousand dollars and running around like, like gods of the industry, okay? And, and this is one case of a million, okay? You have all kinds of, there's other coaches running around that have been discovered to not even have banged 10 girls yet, which means they're in single-digit lay count. Okay, I can bang 10 girls on a good week, okay? And these guys, and, and then it's discovered even further that, that like eight of them came from Tinder, okay? So, so here's a guy teaching you about cold approach pickup that hasn't 
fucked any, my first 400 were almost all from night game, okay? And that happened by January of 2015. Okay, I thought online game was cheating and I wasn't of model looks and I thought, okay, if I'm doing all this shit with strategy and tactics, I don't like that some guy that's, that's good looking aesthetically can just go online and bang chicks without having to do all this work and know all this shit, etc. And now I see it at the end of the day as it's just about banging hot chicks, okay? It doesn't matter if it's from fucking Tinder, or Seeking Arrangement, or a nightclub, or a shopping center, okay? I was out with my main fuck buddy a couple of days ago at the supermarket, and there was a super hot Brazilian chick, and I said, hey, do you wanna approach that girl together and have a threesome with her? It's not the one from my videos, it's a different one. And she's like, no, but you can. She's like, thank you for asking me. Like, and I'm like, you're not gonna get mad? She's like, no, like, I just don't like when you go and do, you know, try to be shady behind my back, etc. So went and got the girl's number, and that girl's coming over tomorrow, right? And she's like, aren't you with that girl? I'm like, yeah, but I still wanna meet up with you. She's like, cool, right? And then, you know, so the point is, is that like Chris Wilde has no business even getting a cent from anyone in the industry, okay? It doesn't matter if he has a fucking Facebook group with a bunch of followers, okay, like Chen City, okay? Chen City is this fucking retard, okay? It's an Asian kid, looks like he has Down syndrome, okay, that got a hand tattoo, like Alexander Lindbergh and UMP, and he's like, Chen City, Chen City, like, quarantine and chill, let's break down these other coaches. Get the fuck out of here, okay? You have no business in here. Even, even Alexander Lindbergh fucking went through my product, okay? And fucking, uh, who else? Like John Damien, uh, a German coach, he went through my product. A lot of these guys, what they do is, they buy stuff from the best coaches in the, in the industry, they repackage it, and then they're teaching a watered down, shitty version of it, okay? And they have no idea of the ins and outs, they don't have the experience, okay? It's like if I read a book on some field of, of skill mastery, right? And then I was like recounting the things. I don't have the heuristics built up in my brain. I don't have the experience. I don't, I, I can't, like you ask me any pickup question, I can rattle off an optimal answer very quickly because I devoted my entire life to this, okay? I've, I've eaten, breathed, and slept this shit. And these, these new guys that come on the scene, the guys are just handing their money out to, are fucking retards, okay? They don't know shit. They've copied other people's stuff. And they, they haven't like done the blood, sweat, and tears stuff, okay? Just because, like, like one guy actually, I found out there's, there's some guy, modern life dating or whatever, and he's gonna get fucking blown apart. Apparently he's making a Corona product. He bought my Corona product, surprise, surprise, two weeks ago, and then tried to refund it. Okay, and I have the, the, the email, it even opened a PayPal dispute over 50 bucks, right? And it, it's like this whole like plea to PayPal. That's like about as big of a faggot as you can get, okay? Well, maybe we will name the, the, the title of the, that video, uh, Faggot of the Year, okay? Although there's a lot of close contenders, such as James Marshall from the Natural Life House. But anyways, I'm getting ahead of myself. Lots of amazing stuff, <laughs> lots of amazing shit to come. Uh, Keep your eyes peeled, and I'll ask one more time. Please help do your part, like, liking, sharing, and subscribing, and let's make some magic happen. John Anthony Lifestyle Gmail for your interested in live training here in Florianopolis, Brazil, or in other parts. Uh, we will see what we can work out. I have coaches all around the world that run programs. It's a little tough during Corona times, but where there's a will, there's a way, and I uh, will be seeing you guys very soon. Take care.